I want to start by thanking everyone for being here uh, for this event. We live in incredibly busy times, all of us do, and I know that there is so much, so much on every plate that finding time to spend in this way is, is something that is not easily, not easily done. So we appreciate your being here with us today. Uh, and we hope that you'll, uh, at, at the end of it all, say that it was completely worthwhile. My name's Bob Brown. I'm the Managing Director of the New Orleans Business Council, uh, and I'm extremely proud for my organization to be partnered with the Committee for Economic Development in bringing you, for the second time now, for the second time now, a very, very uh, interesting and critically important conversation. Just more than a year ago, the Business Council and the Committee for Economic Development teamed up for a similar serious discussion uh, about the nation's debt crisis. These discussions, like that one and like the one we will have today, go to the heart of what the New Orleans Business Council stands for and has stood for for 25 years. And that's speaking with integrity, and a principled voice to frame public policy issues, to foster a highly competitive business environment, and to enhance the opportunity for success for all businesses of all types. Further, the Business Council is always looking for ways to move us, to move all of us to concerted, purposeful and successful action. And there can certainly be no more compelling top topic tied to the enduring health and well-being of our nation than the education of our citizens. So if ever there was an area of national life demanding thoughtful and forceful action, uh, ladies and gentlemen, this is it. The Business Council is mightily engaged here in our city and in our state the Committee for Economic Development looks closely and carefully at this sector from a national perspective. And today, we'll be examining together that critical nexus between those who educate and train, particularly at the community and technical college level, and those who employ, motivate, support, and promote the rich landscape of businesses needing able and productive human capital. So please prepare yourselves for an important dialogue. And we'll start the meal as, as, we are, as we are doing now. But I want to do one more thing, if you'll allow me to, please. I want to acknowledge the chair of the New Orleans Business Council. She is a woman of extraordinary energy, intellect, and passion. She provides inspired leadership to the Business Council and to the community beyond. She's my chairman, Suzanne Medier. Thank you. Thank you, Suzanne. And now lunch is being served. Please enjoy the company at your table. We'll restart our proceedings in roughly 20 minutes. Thank you all so much. <laughs>